हेलो एवरी वन नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू डू द पोएम ऑन फर्स्ट लुकिंग इन टू चैफ माई सोमर सो दिस इज अ सोनेट रिटर्न बाय जॉन केट्स इन एटीन सिक्सटीन एंड सोनेट इज ऑफ फोर्टीन लाइन्स एंड दिस इज अ पेट्रार्कन सोनेट विद राइम स्कीम ए बी बी ए ए बी बी ए सी डी सी डी सी डी सो दिस सोनेट इज अ ट्रिब्यूट टू जॉर्ज चैफमैन हु वॉज एलिजाबेथन ड्रामाटिस्ट एंड हु ट्रांसलेटेड होमर्स एपिक्स इलियड एंड ऑडिसी फ्रॉम ग्रीक लैंग्वेज इन टू इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज so uh, actually kids friend cowden clark informed him about joe chapman's translation and uh, kids was so fascinated after reading homer's works that he decided to write a tribute to george chapman you know with this sonnet so he starts the poem by talking about his imaginative journey to the various great works of literature and here realms of gold mean uh, golden kingdom of poetry and drama so he starts the line by saying that he has traveled uh, to various uh, you know great works of literature is not talking about his uh, you know physical journey or he has not made any trip but he is talking about his literary journey so here he is a traveler you know uh, in a literary manner so he has traveled in his imagination so then he says that he has read great works by great poets like spenser milton and shakespeare and he has also read you know uh, the poets writing under the guidance of god apollo in western islands and uh, then obviously he was just familiar with homer's you know talent and genius as a great writer but uh, uh, when he received george chapman translation of his works only then he was able to read his works and uh, he was so fascinated that he decided to write this poem as a tribute to george chapman so basically uh, the next line here he says that uh, that when he read homer's works then he uh, it was a new experience for him and it opened a new world of poetry for him and he was filled with wonder and uh, excitement and uh, he compares this wonder and excitement with that of an astronomer who discovers a new planet and to spanish explorer cortez and his man who discovered pacific ocean so they were so excited uh, after discovering pacific ocean that they were left numb and they were not able to utter a single word and and they were just looking at the ocean in complete silence so uh, for kids also it was a new experience it was a very fascinating experience and he that's why he compares his experience uh, with that of an astronomer who discovers a new planet and uh, to spanish explorer cortez when he discovered pacific ocean so these are the two similes which are used by kids in this poem so here darien is a place which connects south america and uh, north america and uh, cortez with his man was standing on Uh, on on a peak in darien so this is the poem so basically this poem is about the ecstatic joy and the wonder that kids felt after first reading you know uh, homer's works that uh, he wrote this poem